वन थिंग आई रियलाइज दिस दिस कि अगर मेरी जिंदगी का साउंड ट्रैक कुक होता तो देन आई वुड हैव बीन मच मोर आई थिंक हैप्पी मोर सक्सेसफुल देन आई एम राइट नाउ आई वुड नो जॉइस दैट मे बी नो पर्सन हैज नोन बिफोर बिकॉज इन दिस फिल्म एवरी टाइम दिस साउंड ट्रैक प्लेज आई वॉज लाइक वाओ दिस दिस इज वट आई नीड इन माई बैकग्राउंड दिस इज द साउंड ट्रैक दैट वुड इम्प्रूव माई लाइफ आई एम प्रतीक्षा मिश्र एंड यूर लिस्निंग टू माई रिव्यू ऑफ ट्रू अगर आपने ट्रेलर देखा है तो आपको इस फिल्म का बेसिक प्रेमिस तो पता होगा ही बट स्टिल आई टेल यू अलिटल बिट देर आर थ्री वेमेन गीता प्लेड बाय तबू दिव्या प्लेड बाय कृति सनॉन एंड जैसमिन प्लेड बाय करीना कपूर ऑल थ्री ऑफ देम आर फ्लाइट अटेंडेंट इन कोहिनूर एयरवेज एयरवेज एयरलाइन द फिल्म स्विच बिटवीन दीज बीच बीच में आई डोट दैट्स एन एरर और इज जस्ट समथिंग दे यूज सिनोनिमसली बट कोहिनूर कोहिनूर मान के चलो Now I don't have to tell you what Kohinoor Airlines Airways is based on neither do I have to tell you what the character Vijay Walia is based on which is played by Shashwat Chatterjee फिल्म की शुरुआत होती है सबकी थोड़ी थोड़ी सी बैक स्टोरी देकर गीता सेठी तबूज कैरेक्टर इज अ ब्यूटी क्वीन और वाज अ ब्यूटी क्वीन एंड नाउ इज अ फ्लाइट अटेंडेंट शी लिव्स विद हर हस्बैंड अरुण प्लेड बाय कपिल शर्मा अरुण का जो एक रेस्टोरेंट बिजनेस था वो उनके भाइयों ने शायद मिलकर हड़प लिया है तो अब वो अपने घर से एक छोटा सा क्लाउड किचन चलाते हैं उन दोनों का सपना है कि किसी तरह बस पैसे जमा हो जाए या तो गीता का पी उनके पास आ जाए और वो गोवा जाके अपना एक रेस्टोरेंट खोल लेंगे देन देर इज दिव्या कृति सनॉन्स कैरेक्टर हु इज ऑलवेज ड्रीम्ड ऑफ बींग अ पायलट Of course, she is a flight attendant now, but उन्होंने अपने माँ बाप से झूठ बोला हुआ है कि वो पायलट है जैसमिन प्लेड बाय करीना कपूर वॉन्ट्स टू बिकम अ सी ई ओ उनका एक बिजनेस है जिसको वो टेक ऑफ कराने की कोशिश कर रही है इन्वेस्टर्स ढूंढ रही हैं पर हो नहीं पा रहा है सो शी ऑफ कोर्स ऑल्सो इज नाउ वर्किंग फॉर द एयरलाइन पर उनके एस्पिरेशन बहुत बड़े हैं शी वॉन्ट्स टू बाय दिस फैंसी ब्रांड शी वॉन्ट्स टू बाय दिस फैंसी कार शी पोज इज विद दम इवन दो शी डजन ओन दम इट्स ऑल एस्पिरेशनल एंड मोस्टली फॉर सोशल मीडिया इनकी जिंदगी में मेन कॉन्फ्लिक्ट अब ये है कि उनको पिछले छह महीनों से सैलरी नहीं मिली है एंड दर कैंड ऑफ हियरिंग रूमर्स कि द एयरलाइंस हैज गॉन बैंक सो नाउ दे डोंट नो व्हाट देयर फ्यूचर होल्ड्स फॉर देम अब इसी के चलते चलते एक हादसा हो जाता है एंड सम हाउ दे एंटर द वर्ल्ड ऑफ क्राइम दे एसेंशली हैव टू नो स्मगल गोल्ड जब वो इस रैकेट में आ जाते हैं गोल्ड स्मगलिंग के दे मीट अ फ्यू कैरेक्टर्स एक कैरेक्टर है तृप्ति खामकर का कैरेक्टर व्हिच इज सब इंस्पेक्टर माला जो हाथ धो के उनके पीछे पड़ी है क्योंकि उनको पता है कि इन्होंने कुछ ना कुछ तो किया है बस सबूत नहीं मिल रहा वी ऑल्सो मीट दिलजीत दोसांस कैरेक्टर हु इज कृति सनॉन्स कैरेक्टर्स लव इंटरेस्ट हेयर वो लोग शायद पहले कॉलेज में मिले थे एंड नाउ दर कैन ऑफ ट्राइंग टू रीकेंडल दैट रोमांस उन दोनों का केमिस्ट्री ऑन स्क्रीन इज एब्सोल्यूटली फैबुलस एंड दैट इज ऑल्सो बाय लॉट ऑफ द रोमांस कैंड ऑफ सेल्स क्रू को क्या बोले बड़ी कॉमेडी बोले हाइस्ट बोले क्योंकि एट सम पॉइंट हाउस को इज दिस आर ओशन एट क्योंकि सेटअप थोड़ा सा वैसा आपको फील कराता है बट इट्स नो वेर क्लोज टू दैट फिल्म We don't have to compare it even. I was just kind of hoping that it would be that good, but still, Crew isn't a bad movie. It's actually quite fun. बहुत सारे scenes इसके हैं where you're kind of laughing out loud. The comedy often lands. There are some jokes that don't, and it's usually the ones that are kind of crass. And not in the sense that oh, they're crass, so they're not funny. They're just not written well for that genre of jokes. Best parts of the film come from the chemistry that the main lead actors are sharing. Tino's performances are marvelous, and it really helps that Tino's characters, un actors, ko mind me rakh ke likhe gaye hain. Karina Kapoor ko chhod ke Jasmine ka character sa koi nahi kar sakta tha. And Kriti Sanon plays Divya with just a gusto that is so fun to see on screen. I generally think this is one of her better performances in her career. All the characters at some points do feel like archetypes but the film does write them smartly in the sense that they're very relatable. We get to see how the relationships are with the people around them. I also like that we don't have a very basic family unit across characters. Kyunki Jasmine's character for example lives with her grandfather. They have a different equation. There's also Geeta Sethi's equation with her husband and also her brother pops in beech beech mein. We get to see that relationship as well. And I also like that Geeta has a very sensitive relationship with her brother's wife. We have Divya lying to her parents but still has a bit of a very soft kind of heartwarming relationship with them and also we see how her equation with her brother plays out so a lot of this kind of plays into how warm and how just nice these characters can feel and we also see how all these characters do have their flaws they have entered a world of crime for instance but wo flaws mein beech beech mein dekhne ko milte hain a lot of their credit also of course goes to the writers nidhi mehra and mehul suri we see that geeta sethi maybe lives with anxiety but that isn't explored well enough for you to actually kind of understand what's going through her mind crew might be mounted well but i did feel a little let down by the camera work it's very basic for a film like this in the genre of badi comedy chalo side mein hatao agar hum heist ka genre hi dekh le you need camera work that matches it and a basic camera work just doesn't cut it in a genre like this and here that did end up happening i was distracted by how some shots just did not seem impressive enough for this film 
The background score also isn't anything special as such. I did like the kind of cook 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 that keeps entering the film. Of course, that's from Choli Ke Piche Kya Hai, sung by Alka Yagnik and Ila Arun. Yahan pe uska remix kiya gaya hai. I thought I would absolutely hate it because I love the song, but I didn't. One thing I noticed during this film is that someone, anyone, needs to capitalize on the chemistry between Kareena Kapoor and Tabu because oh my god, oh my god, amazing chemistry, and someone needs to capitalize on that. I do like the idea that they didn't think of giving everyone a love. Love interest. I like that these women can exist just as characters or individuals of their own in this film. There are parts where the film is just too loud. It feels like it's loud just for being loud sake. Because silence may be, or muted kind of sounds may be, comedy can happen. Even the slapstick one. Because my favorite sequence is one that doesn't have a lot of loudness, if you will. It's where they fully cannot manage to drug someone because she's a picky eater. Unko samaj hi nahi aa raha because wo kuch khai nahi rahi hai, na kuch pi rahi hai. She's like, oh, this is too sweet, this is too sour, this is too watery. So they can't give her the sleeping pills. I also enjoy that we have this kind of raunchy humor in the film as well. There are parts where that kind of also doesn't fit very well, but I love that it's a part of these women's lives. We often see this kind of happen through a male gaze here that isn't very prevalent. Though I did sense some scenes where that was kind of happening. Crew is not a perfect film. Beach May, it just becomes very very dull. I found myself getting a little bored. I stayed with it just because of how fabulous the performances are. I wanted to see how they would kind of take the story forward, but the screenplay and the writing did kind of stumble in the middle. Where I was like, ठीक है. आगे बढ़ो आई गेट इट सेटिंग हो गया ये सब चीजें हो रही हैं लेट्स मूव ऑन एंड दैट हैपेंस इन द हाइस्ट सीक्वेंस एंड आई थिंक दैट इज बिकॉज दिस इज अ वेरी बेसिक हाइस्ट देर इज नथिंग नॉवल अबाउट द कॉन्सेप्ट एज सच सो यू काइंड ऑफ डोंट हैव एनीथिंग टू बी इधर हुक्ड ऑन टू और बी सरप्राइज बाय तो आपको थोड़ा सा वो डल लगने लग जाता है I don't think I have never not been impressed by Tabu. I was excited about Kuru for Tabu. Her acting in this film I think is my favorite even though she does feel a little underutilized. Unke hai kafi solid punches film mein but I just feel like we could have done more. We could have done more with her character but she does it so well. This kind of woman who is resilient, really trying to just give her and her husband the dream that they want and also at the same time kind of keep control of the situation kind of Handle everybody around her. It's just a very well-written character, but वो पूरी तरह से realize नहीं हो पाता because it ends up being a little superficial. Kareena Kapoor giving us the best, just her pulpy as just the 2000s K3G drama and just the sass. It's all back and it's so fun to see on screen. मुझे तो मजे आ गए. Kriti Sanon does get overshadowed by the absolute legends that she's working with, but not in a bad way. It's not that you won't remember her. She does hold her ground quite a bit. Diljit Dosanjh and Kapil Sharma both give very decent performance. Performances, but unka is film me zada role hai nahi, and I'm not complaining. They play these kind of green flag men who are just there to help the story along and just stand by the side of the women that they love. And I, I love that, love that. It's so rare for us to see that on screen. So itna I will take it. I will buy that. It's fine. Shashwat Chatterjee is again a little underutilized. He's a fabulous actor. I feel like he could have done a lot with a role like this if it was a little meatier. Crew might not be just a laugh riot, if you will, but it does do enough to keep your attention. It's fun for like to just sit and eat some popcorn and watch a film and just relax and sit and just kick back for a bit. Crew, like one of its penultimate scenes, is a flight that has taken off but doesn't exactly know where to go, and the turbulence in between does not help. अगर आपका बीच में इंटरेस्ट थोड़ा छूट जाएगा, I wouldn't blame you, but I would kind of ask you to try and stay with it, see where the actors are taking the film because they deserve a lot of applause and also a much better film. That being said, Crew is not a bad film. Good Friday, good movie. Maybe go watch it. Tell me what you think. And that is why my rating for Crew is three stars out of five.